So XDAdevelopers.com posted the article today, and they posed an interesting question, especially when we saw recently Motorola come out with two versions of their flippable cell phone. One with a beautiful outside display that spans the whole entire outside, and one that's a very small one-by-one -one ratio. Of course, the small outside display is the cheaper product. Now, we have seen Samsung release fan editions of the Galaxy S series, Galaxy S20 fan edition, Galaxy S21 fan edition, so on and so on. So the question is, should Samsung release a fan edition of the Galaxy Z Flip 5 or the Galaxy Z Fold 5? Let's go ahead and talk about this, because this would be quite the interesting take. Especially because they could then sell the fan edition for around $700 instead of it being $900 some odd dollars. Well, actually, no, $1,100, which you have to pay for the full Z Flip 5. And this is an example of what Motorola did, which is, in all honesty, a very smart idea. So if you do not know what a fan edition of a Galaxy phone is, pretty much what they do is they take the best features that everybody loves about the Galaxy S, let's say, for example, 20. They take all of the best features and they put it into a cell phone, but it, with a cheaper build. So it might be plastic. It might not have certain features like wireless charging. It might not have, you know, the biggest battery. But it's going to give you all the other features you love about that cell phone. So it's, again, a fan edition. It's a cheaper made cell phone that gives you all the features you get from the flagship phone. And again, that's kind of what the Motorola did with their two cell phones. They have a, one with a beautiful outside display and a one-by-one -one ratio outside display. I think it could work for the Z Flip series, especially because you could just say, hey, listen, if you, want to, if you love the Z Flip 4, well, this is the Z Flip 5 Fan Edition, which is just the Z Flip 4 with the outside display being very small. But you get the new hinge, you also get a upgraded processing unit, and you get a better inside display, like more durable inside display. That could be that, right? That could be very easy for Samsung to do. Just take the Z Flip 4, upgrade a tad bit, don't add the beautiful outside display, then charge $300 less for it. They, it takes them less money to make the phone because obviously you're not using outside display. You're reusing the Z Flip 4's outside display. Bam. Fan edition. The Z Fold 5 would be harder to do the fan edition for. I feel like because it's not that much of an upgrade. Um, and I'm not saying that in the aspect range of that's a hot take. I mean, Samsung and Poise themselves came out and said that, you know, listen, at the end of the day, you know, this is not really much of an upgrade. But if they did a fan edition, it would be called the Galaxy Z Fold 4. <laughs> That's really what I feel like it would be called. Um, let me think. Because they can't make it a plastic shell because it's a foldable phone. Okay, they have to make it. So what I would assume they would do is, and actually right now I believe the Galaxy Z Fold series already is aluminum body. I was going to say at least like, you know, iPhones have stainless steels and then they have aluminum. I believe the Galaxy Z Fold series is aluminum. So they have to keep going to aluminum. Maybe in the fan edition give you a lesser processor. So a Galaxy Z Fold 5 with a Gen 1 processor. But it has the, you know, hinge that is upgraded. Maybe it also has the, you know, isn't much of an upgrade. I'm like thinking about what they could do. But I'm like thinking about the differences between the two phones. The crease in the middle is a little bit different. And... By them not upgrading the processing unit, then maybe they charge like $200 less. It doesn't really work with a Z Fold 5, okay? Z Flip 5, you could do it with. But a Z Fold 5, it just doesn't make sense. Because the phone's already so expensive that they're actually now just going out of the way to create a lesser product. And it's not really going to sell right. The Z Flip 5 makes sense because you're like, hey, listen, if you like the Z Flip 4 and you just want an upgraded processing unit, but you don't want to fork over all this money, here you go, $700, $600, you can get yourself a Z Flip 5, but fan edition. That makes sense. Tell me down below your thoughts and opinions, because I just don't think 
They could do it with the Z Fold series. I think they could do a Z Flip series, but Z Fold, it's hard to sell that. My personal opinion, again. Tell me down below your thoughts, pins. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.